Now it's time for the 12 Sports Zone, brought to you by Toyota. Good evening and welcome inside the 12 Sports Zone. Thanks for joining us. Black Bear shortstop Ethan Paul joined the team later than most players do after winning a national championship with Vanderbilt and it's built him a solid fan base that pays attention even though he's no longer in Nashville. Take a look. It's been a good year for Ethan Paul. Paul helped Vanderbilt win its second baseball national title in the last six years. Before that, he got drafted in the ninth round of the Major League Baseball draft, and now he's the everyday shortstop for the West Virginia Black Bears. From the college side, when I was in it, you know, it was happening so fast here, just trying to be in the moment and enjoy it. But, you know, now that I'm out of it and I'm able to take a step back and just appreciate what happened and that experience that I had um, this year in college ball. So, Definitely something I'm going to remember for a very long time, and um, you know I'm very grateful for all the opportunities I've been given. You know I'm trying to make the best of each opportunity I have. Helping lead his college team to a national title has earned Paul a following. Black Bears fans see the potential he has, and Vanderbilt fans are actively following his journey in the minors on social media. I think that's just you know it comes with the program itself and how Coach Corbin runs it. You know even the guys that leave the program, they're celebrated by the fans and. The, former and, and current players. So, um, yeah, I definitely appreciate it a lot. It goes a long way to know that former fans are keeping up with me and they're pulling for me, and it just makes you appreciate where you come from a lot more. Paul debuted for the Black Bears on July 8th, almost a full month after opening day of the 2019 season. And even though he hasn't been with the team that long, he feels himself getting more comfortable. Just playing every day. I mean, even in college baseball and D1 baseball, you don't play every single day. so. You know, you've got to, you got to carry that mindset and know that you got to be able to flush things or move past things quickly because you got to gain the next day. So that's probably been the biggest adjustment so far. And even now that he's getting settled in at the top of the lineup in the box and up the middle defensively, he's not concerned with any outside expectations. Uh, I don't think I've placed any expectations on myself personally. You know, you have, you know, minute goals or things like that that you want to accomplish or, you know, you want to check boxes off and, and develop as a player. But, um, no, I don't have any you know, real expectation of myself. I just want to continue to develop and be the best version of myself. One of the boxes he's already checked off is his first career home run, which sailed into the Black Bears bullpen in just his eighth game in the minors and was sitting in his locker waiting for him after the game. Great stuff there from Ethan Paul. And we'll have more Black Bears conversations over the next few weeks, and you can always view our previous ones online. Make sure to stay with us. We'll have a final look at the weather coming up.